This simple bit of home maintenance helps to prevent heat loss and save on your heating bill. Windows are a common source of air leaks, especially if your house is old and drafts can get in between the wall and the window frame. To seal these air leaks from the inside, you can caulk around the window frame. If the gap between the wall and the frame is narrow, then a squeezable tube of caulking should do the job. Use a utility knife to cut the tip of the tube at the right angle. Be sure the hole you cut is as wide as the widest gap you need to fill. A larger gap will require a caulking gun. You'll also need a utility knife, a long nail or a piece of wire, a few rags, some soapy water, and a tube of long-lasting caulk. Be sure to use latex-based interior caulk. Unlike silicone caulk, which is also harder to clean during application, latex caulk can be painted over when dry. Before you begin, take a moment to familiarize yourself with the caulking gun. Pulling the trigger activates the plunger, which squeezes out the caulk and controls the flow. Pressing the release lever stops the flow. Start by cleaning the surface. Use a clean, wet rag to remove dust and any loose paint. Make sure all surfaces are completely dry before you caulk. Next, prep the caulking cartridge. Use a utility knife to cut the tip of the nozzle at a right angle. Be sure the hole you cut is as wide as the widest gap you need to fill. Pierce the cartridge seal by pushing a long nail or a piece of wire into the nozzle. Load the cartridge into the gun without pulling the trigger. Hold the gun at right angles to the frame. Lightly pull the trigger and keep the pressure constant while moving steadily along the joint in one direction. Release the trigger when you reach the end of the frame. Make sure the caulk has adhered to both sides of the joint. If not, add more caulk to any spots you may have missed. Now, wet your finger with soapy water and smooth out the bead. The caulk will start drying after about five minutes, so keep wetting your finger as necessary and continue smoothing the bead before the caulk starts to dry. And there you go, you're done. For more EnergyWise tips, be sure to visit our website.